we have uh, done a couple of dress rehearsals up to this point where we're running the show with lights and sounds and adding in the costumes and then rehearsing the costume changes because in the show there are a lot of quick changes. Uh, usually that's a change for an actor that's under a minute or a minute and a half where they have dressers who are helping them change so we rehearse all of that. So hopefully, if all goes well tonight, we'll run the show uh, as we will tomorrow night at the preview without stopping. So the lights, sounds, scenery, everything will run properly and we can do a full run of the show. No, it's a public performance, so it's a ticket that isn't at the full price because if something should happen, we might have to stop the performance. Say a piece of scenery got stuck during a transition that we were still working out. It very, very seldom happens, but the sort of the flip side of preview is you're the first audience, and then if something happens, you also get to see us working it out still before we get to the opening, which is Saturday. We have a, a lot of our second year conservatory actors in this production, and so for some of them, it's their first time on this stage. And then, of course, we have the Von Trapp children. So we have some children who are veterans uh, who've done shows with us before and a couple who've not uh, done shows with us. But pretty much everyone, of course, has done shows other places. It's really getting used to our way of doing things. Uh, it's the last production that Rodgers and Hammerstein did together, and I think they're the great uh, American musical theater collaborators, certainly from the golden age of musical theaters. And this is their last show. Uh, Hammerstein died right after it opened. And uh, so it's kind of a, you know, there's a sentimental quality to that. They were so at the height of their power as writing team. And then this is the last show they did. Uh, it was a, written as a vehicle for Mary Martin. And uh, she found the story and brought it to them. And they created uh, The Sound of Music really with her in mind. A terrific show. We're doing it as a holiday show for the whole family. So in our season, it's something that we really want to, we want to produce as a gift to the community, something that's appropriate for grandparents and grandkids and uh, whole families to come and enjoy the theater together around the holidays. Oh,